Hey everybody, welcome back to some more Shantae. Yeah. We are back in Devin's Nightmare. Yep. <laughs> Admittedly, we have spent more time on easier puzzles. So, <laughs> gonna give him a pass on this one. Yeah. Oh, so bad. Okay, so I hold it, I go too far. I don't hold it, I don't go far enough. Good to know. Tap it in. Yep. Tappa, tappa, tappa. <laughs> Subtlety is the key, I guess. You had it. Yeah, I know. And you panicked. Yep. <sighs> Best death. Best one yet. Holy shit. You oh, just walked off. <laughs> Holy shit. <sighs> what an awkward mechanic that it slides down. When it's asking you to be precise. And then says, no, you can't be precise. Go fuck yourself. Yep. Hey. A thing happened. Okay. It was mostly positive. Yep. All right, this could be a new personal best. All right. Ah, yeah. oh, fuck. Oh, well. I mean, really kind of open for a mermaid upgrade. Oh, here's the best part of it, though. Now we have no fucking idea where the mermaid upgrade is because we've checked everything. No, there's still one spot to check. Okay. Now, what happens if you suicide here? Does it take you back to the cave now? Let's find out. Yep. Shit. All right. To say, if it took you all the way back to the other end, you could warp back to the other side. Yeah. Although, where's the map? Still might be better to warp back to the other side. My... Yeah, because the warp point is one screen... Yeah. You should definitely be warping... Going left and then warping over. That's way shorter. Yeah. Alright. As far as efficiency goes... I mean, the minute there's these goddamn totems in the air, most concept of efficiency is disappearing. Yep. But, eh. It's probably still faster than running ten screens to go one screen. And then I do shit like that. Yeah, shit happens. Yeah. <laughs> these are the worst fucking thing. The worst fucking thing. You're the worst fucking thing. Oh my god. Much like the Ethiopian track doctor, my patients are running thin. <laughs> what? <laughs> wow. That is fantastic. <laughs> oh god damn it. I thought oh, you were gonna fall in so between did those I. two. So I did I. <laughs> Oh. You saved it a time that you really didn't need to. Yep. Oh, let me make this epic save the one time there's ground oh. underneath me. So, that wasn't that bad. No. Save that sweet ass magic jam. Yep. One more screen of shittiness. And get to warp. Easy mode. Yep. Yeah, no, seriously, the lack of fucking pirate flares in this game is vicious. Really and that, is. again, the separation between save points and warp points. Um, there's something else. I wonder... There hasn't been anything else in that area right beside me the entire time, has there? That's where the mayor was. We picked uh, up something from him. Okay. Yep. All right, so back to Mermaid Cliffs. Yep. And if it's not there, I'm looking it up. Yep. Honestly, we've seen the rest of the fucking map. I don't know where else it could be. Well, how many caves have we been in that we couldn't do something at? None that I can think of that we now could. The only ones I can think of are the ones that had the gray blocks above you 
and you still don't have the ability to do anything about that. Which is why there has to be at least one other, at least one other upgrade. Yeah. Oh shit! Wasted it. Yep. Oh, because he thought you had pike balls equipped. Yep. I sure did. Is that motherfucker respawning as soon as you kill it? I think so. That is just fucking mean. This fucking game, man. I know. Wait. Hold on. I need to go back there. That's where I'm going to go. This game is way fucking harder than Pirate's Curse. Yeah. Just as an observation. Like, I've beaten Pirate's Curse. <laughs> and from observing, I would say this game looks way fucking harder. It it feels harder. There, there's a lot of different things. Like, just different ways everything moves. Or, yeah. Man. There's, and, and there's a lot of similarity, too, which is always interesting. Mm -hmm. And I was saying, they showed some of that more Half Genie Hero footage at E3. And it definitely looks like Half Genie Hero is going to be a lot more like um, yes. Risky's Revenge than it is Pirate's Curse. Because it has the transformations. That's not what I expected. I don't know why I thought that purple block was floor. <laughs> Layers, bro. <sighs> and they've shown at least five transformations? I think so. Elephant, mermaid, and monkey again. Yeah. And then also spider and crab? Yep. God damn it. Unless you trade those two fucking things or something for... Wait, is... Where's Squid Baron? Well, we fought Squid Baron, didn't we? He was, like, in the first dungeon? Yeah. I wonder if we could trade them to him or something. Yeah. Son of a bitch. So, now that we've done this... Is there anywhere else you specifically think you want to go? I just wanted to find that other... That obvious mermaid upgrade, because that's what's blocking us with everything underwater right now. Yeah. So, why don't you go back to town, yeah. buy some upgrades, and basically... Fuck, we're not even that much in this, no. into this episode. Well, we're like eight minutes in. That's a really short episode. Right, but you still have to get back to town, which is not generally an easy process. I've got to get to a warp point. Oh, right. Cause it, there, <laughs> I, I thought there was more between you and that last warp point. Oh, fuck. Well, start with that. Yeah. And we'll look it up before we come back next time. If you can. We know for a fact that we went through that entire fucking desert area 19 times. Yes. I... Firmly believe there was nothing we missed. Yeah. In the uh, desert. But we know that for a fact there was multiple caves that we that we saw. I still only remember one, but the most of them were in the forest, I think. Yeah. Guess what? I don't have. I still don't have pike balls. <laughs> or any potions, but way to just tank through it. <laughs> Before I fucking forget. Put pike ball back on? Yeah. Well, you're going to be putting a better pike ball on in a second. That's true. Unless there's something else worth buying, but I think that's it. I think that's the most worth. Pretty certain. What are our options? You want to buy some golden squins, motherfucker? Uh, um, magic meter automatically refills. Yeah, but money oh. I don't think is going to be the issue here. Oh, I think I'll actually have enough of that, too. Yeah. Oh, this oh, is it's only, only two. two. And 300. Yeah, you can get both. Totally worth. Yeah. And buy health potions with whatever you have left. Oh, yeah. Actually, how much is the triple fireball? One in 50? Might be worth it to up your... I don't know. I'm going to fucking... It's up to you. Yeah. I've yet to really use those for anything other than utility. I know, but what if you do... Or what if you did because they're better? Or what if it's 
when you get to the boss, there's like a forced ranged section. Just a thought. You're yeah. also not done. There's still shit to do. So you... And it's only 50. You have nine potions and you still have enough. It was the magic jam thing, but I don't see anything else coming in for the magic jam. So. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, there's nothing else to save magic jam for. Yeah. Cool. There we go. In the new one, they show it with like six pike balls. Fucking right. <laughs> Just to... They're actually spinning swords, but... It's like a catastrophe of fuck you. This doesn't work, dude. Oh, that's right. I forgot. It's like a... That lets you, like... You get money if you have saved data from other way forward Game Boy Advance games. Oh, okay. But we have no way of to import save data on mm. a Wii. It's like a link cable thing or something. It's... That was not scary. something that's possible. Plus, we don't have any of those games anyway. Yeah. Yeah, not a bad idea. Yeah. So Sky wasn't in her place. Really? Yep. Interesting. What do you? Thought I had to bring the magic seals to Sky. Actually, no, to Uncle. Oh, to Uncle, who's also not here. Okay. Well, then they're probably all somewhere together. Hopefully. <laughs> they're going to be at the resort. What resort? That, where the mayor was. Oh, motherfucker, they better not be. It's a warp. I know, but still. The fuck y'all doing? Hey. Only thing I can think of. A bunch of jerk-offs. Yeah. Right, so as far as we can tell, this lack of mermaid upgrade isn't actually stopping us from progressing. No. But just getting us, stopping us from getting a couple chests. Yeah. Which honestly are probably more magic jam. Uh, it could be heart containers. I, we don't know what the max heart container is in this one. Yeah, I guess. I think it's six. From what I read. So I'm missing at least one. We don't know where these golden heart where these golden squids go. Yeah. Well, I'll know that before next episode. Okay, that's new. That definitely was not there before. 100% positive for that. Yup. Well, it's a good thing I just saved. Yup. Also, they're clearly not there. Yeah. Huh. Uh. No, it pretty rowdy. clearly said take them back to Uncle. So where is that asshole? You can go to Roddy. See if she's got anything. Oh, that's so weird. Oh, they've probably been captured by Risky. Like, that's all that's yeah. happened. Yeah. Yeah. You notice how they've thrown those bats in here too now? They weren't in this area before. Oh no, I didn't notice that. They seem like the type of asshole who's just everywhere. <laughs> it never really said where to take the magic seals, did it? Just to. Just like, there was no lore about take it here, there, or whatever. <laughs> That's why not. Okay. It's the Crush Puff. It is the Crush Puff. It's why it's giving you magic there. Yeah. I didn't buy the crush buff, right? No. Nope. Alright, so we need at least one more magic jam. No, it was two. 
You sure? Yep, because that was just... It's two for the third upgrade. Okay, well, I could be wrong, but I was pretty sure it was two. And also you have... Yeah. That mini management, though. <clears throat> well, honestly, I don't... We're at 16 minutes. I don't see the point of it wandering aimlessly. I'm, I'm going to Roddy. It's okay. the last place I can think of. Okay, we'll get to Roddy. I'm going to believe she's gone, too, but... Yeah. Oh, I'm sure. Yeah. But, but... Maybe there's a hint. Yeah. Yeah. Fair enough. <clears throat> Excuse me. She wasn't past this. Yeah. No, because you've met her before you got the forest key. I thought she was in that little green spot at the very bottom of the map. Yeah. I I thought that's where she I was. I thought she was too, but honestly, I do not... You met Roddy before you got the forest key, which means there's no logical... You're entering a dungeon. She wasn't in a dungeon. Is this a dungeon? I thought this was just It's a, a mini dungeon. dungeon. That's yeah. Right. Yeah. No, you're right. For some reason, I thought this was just to get past that gap. I think you're right. But yeah, yeah you're right. Sorry. Yeah, no, when you enter her screen, it's just, it's her in front of the carriage. Yeah. Where are you now? You know, you're, that's where I thought she was too. Maybe we're just one plane off. Yeah. Interesting that they start to fill the world with more difficult enemies. Yeah, it's a, it's a neat way to increase the challenge. Yeah. This we did. That chest up there is open. Yeah. So. Okay, the one all the way at the top. That's the chef. Yeah. Where the f so maybe she was at the entrance of that last area and she is just gone. That's also a distinct possibility. Uh, I remember. Do you? Yeah. Right idea. Wrong execution. Do you have to run past that? Instead of in that cave, you have to jump over and around. Oh, uh, okay. Well, she's not gone. <sighs> Yeah, we know. Thanks for nothing. Yeah. I... Yeah, I got nothing else. Yep. But, well, no. Well, I'll look it up, and I'll hint him in the right direction to try to keep it fair. Um, as always, guys, thank you so much for watching. We will see you next time. Um, be sure to come back for more, and we will see you then. Have a good one, guys. Bye. Bye. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just a case of figuring out who to give the gold squids to. But anyway, we'll see you guys. Have a good one, guys.